Hey, what's going on guys? It's Draco and welcome back to another and the final episode of the Sims Homeless Challenge. But as you guys can see, the Homeless Challenge we started off like months ago at this point. You know, I'll leave the previous episodes down below, of course, if you guys would like to check those out. We finally got Uncle Ray here house and even a little family. No, you can't use that bathroom, Mabel. You use the one outside. Yeah, come here right now and use your toilet. Thank you. Okay, I'm really confused. He found a fish in the swimming pool. There's not water for, like, <laughs> miles. So if you guys do end up enjoying, please remember to drop a like and subscribe. And comment down below what other Sims 4 content you guys would like to see. So suggest some other playthroughs that you guys would like to see. Uncle Ray is going Beyblade mode here in the swimming pool. Oh, never mind. He stopped. Oh, no, he's starting up again. I think it'd be perfect for Uncle Ray here to celebrate his um, non-homelessness and take a night out on the town. You're not exactly in the right attire. He does not care the look. <laughs> yeah, no shit, you're cold. You're not wearing any clothes. Man, this place is just absolutely off the charts today. Oh, okay, he's gonna sing some karaoke. Let's see what he's got in him. No, I forgot. This is Uncle Ray's first time leaving the house after becoming a celebrity. This is actually pretty big for him, but he probably should be getting a way more attention than he is right now. Oh, uh, look at this smug bastard. I think he's enjoying himself a little bit too much. Ah, uh, this is gonna be fun. Well, as we learned from many, many episodes, Fireplaces burn things very easily. So I'm just gonna block all the doorways, all the exits with campfires, and then light them all off at the same time. All right, Uncle Ray, start lighting these bad boys up. Oh, there we go. Aw, oh, come on, no, don't burn yourself. Oh, this guy's freaking out. He's never met an old man shirtless before. Oh, wait, no, I'm a celebrity, that's right. Look at him strutting around again, man. He's so excited for arson. All right, there's a few fires burning here on the property, but nothing yet. All right, so every wall or every door is blocked off except for the garage door, which I don't even think they can use. All right, you know, I'm gonna Google this, make sure I'm doing this right. <laughs> wait a second, wait a second. Was I just sitting nude on this chair? Okay, so I'm like streaking with the little dog following me around. Look at him. He's barking at me. Oh, God. All right, we added some people to the little bunch here, so I'm going to put up another wall. Now that we got a few more bodies in here for the warmth, maybe I can get a big fire going? She's like, hmm, something smells over here. She's standing in front of a naked old guy. Has stink fumes coming off of him. So, ladies, you guys impressed? Oh, she's really excited. Oh, God. Just go around lighting all the fires. I'm going to be really upset if I never get this to work, but surely something's got to light on fire soon enough. Imagine some random old man comes and curls up next to you on the couch butt-ass naked. <laughs> this plant is as close as it can be, so surely it's got to get high enough or just hot enough to burn. Come on, someone light on fire for feck's sake. I like how they're having normal conversations. This woman just knows it's the end. <laughs> He's so determined. <laughs> I wish this dog was a little bit more flammable. All right, add a log. Oh, he passed out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this might this must be a not so pretty picture. All right. No, what if we pranked the toilet then used it then try to make more garbage? Did you just not repair? Oh, he passed out again. Christ almighty. All right. So the garbage isn't spawning. What if I moved the toilet out to a more open area? <laughs> what if I move the toilet? Let's say here move the plant. I don't know here. Right, there you go. Pranked it. Now he's taking a leak and now it's broken. Oh, she just wet herself. You know, you could use that toilet, right? You just need to fix it. No, no one will use use the bathroom unless it's repaired none of them know how to have any handiness skill so there's a pile of piss there's a puddle of piss there's probably gonna be another puddle of piss soon enough i think i heard someone piss themselves yeah oh yeah right there it's probably the dog there's some trash right there all right let's move that right there we go that should be good surely one of these gotta burn right come on this can't be all for nothing I don't believe that. Oh, it's happy hour at the karaoke bar. Everyone will enjoy drinks at a discounted price. Okay. All right, there are three massive fires next to these very flammable objects, and I don't see anything lighting on fire. All right, apparently placing a rug underneath a fire is a good idea, so I'm going to try that right here. Cooking with a very, very cheap stove, obviously. Some crappy counter space. There we go. All right, start cooking. All right, he's going to get hungry soon, so let's cook something for the whole family here. People should be getting pretty hungry soon and start using this really crappy stove oh wait a fire started a fire started where where's the fire are you kidding me outside oh my god everyone's crying and panicking and screaming uncle ray's like fire yes desperate for fun you got your fun what are you talking about are you kidding me 
There was a sprinkler. There's a sprinkler system in here. All right, we got to get rid of those. Okay, there we go. So finally the fire went out. Oh, it's love day. I would love for there to be a massive fire. There we go. No roof. No roof. No ceiling. There we go. He just stole the woman's bathroom's mirror. Okay, interesting. All right, I have another pile of trash. Oh, oh wait. A, a fire started. A fire started. Where? Are you kidding me? It's the same one outside? They keep passing out. <laughs> They're in the middle of an emergency. Uncle Ray's just staring into the the abyss that is his soul right now. He doesn't care. All right, maybe the sprinklers won't go off. I don't think they haven't gone off yet, so hopefully they don't go off at all. Oh, oh, is that the building lighting on fire? Hold on, is it? Oh, wait, no, 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 wait. The fire is definitely inside now. Yes, oh, yes, someone's burning alive. Ha, 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 yes, finally. <laughs> Uncle Ray's just still staring at the... <laughs> Can I go over here? Yeah, just watch them burn alive. <laughs> Look at the look at her face. Love day was awful. No shit. Finally. It only took an hour. What the hell? I've been sitting here for an hour. Oh my god. Is she gonna die yet? Oh, uh, she's gonna pass out next to the fire. That is not a good idea, lady. All right, she has died. 100%. Bye, Miko. Enjoy the afterlife. Caleb discovered the fire. Wow, you just now discovered the fire. Hey, uh, Grim. Why don't you stay for a little bit longer how is this woman still not burning she's like yeah this is this is fine it smells a little funny but yeah this is fine she's just staring down at her friend miko here everyone else is outside just bawling their eyes out she's still just standing in the middle of the fire like yeah there's nothing wrong might pass out yeah she's gonna pass out in the middle of the fire next to her dead friend she still isn't burned alive all right yeah everything is slowly becoming engulfed with flames all right you know what I'm just gonna stand over here and hope I survive the fire. The Grim Reaper's like, yeah, I'll just start another fire, might as well. And another fire, might as well. I might die due to hunger because the fire has been going on for like two in-game days. It is just non-stop and it's, I can't speed it up any further and make it spread anywhere else, so. All these people out here that have been waiting for the fire to stop have gotten stinky, s falling asleep, pissing their pants. <laughs> They've all just been vibing out here as well. My hunger has gotten extremely low and I can't do anything about it unless I call the fire department. I'm too stubborn to do so. That might be the only way I get out of here alive. So, I mean, I did take one life. I probably gave PTSD to all these people and all of these people right here falling asleep on the pavement. There's one last little fire here and I believe, are we good? I think we're good, we're good. All right, everyone. Thanks for having the traumatic experience with me. I'll be on my way. All right, but that took an extremely long time. Everyone's so sad and mourning. Had an awful holiday. Despite the prank going extremely well, it took only one life. Despite that taking an extremely long time, this is actually the perfect way I wanted to end this whole series is moving Uncle Ray into this really nice home. Taking a shower, yeah, that might be a start. I'm just gonna manipulate my way into getting a brand new home and leave my old family behind. You guys can move over here with the old fam. I'll move over here with the new fam. Perfect. Thank you very much. Enjoy your $500, the disappointment of a son, and yeah, thanks for the apartment. Ah, the new apartment. <laughs> it's got literally everything we could possibly want to start our new life. Ah, uh, look at him fast asleep, dreaming about unicorns. But I think that's where we're gonna finally wrap up this little series of the Homeless Challenge, where we are finally not homeless. We're gonna leave that family and that life behind us and start our new life abode with our now $80,000. So let me know what you guys wanna see next from the Sims series. I'm thinking about doing an extremely modded series, but obviously if you would like to give your suggestions or feedback down below in the comments, do so by just, you know, dropping a comment. If you guys did up enjoying, please remember to drop a like and subscribe, turn on post notifications. Hope you guys enjoyed the series. Feels like the end of an era, once again, just like the Road 96 series but it's finally come to an end. Thank you guys so much for watching once again, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.